Here's the story of my 1977 F100. In September of uh, 2020, uh, the truck and I celebrated 43 years together. Back in the uh, summer of uh, 1977 in the province of New Brunswick in Canada, the uh, Ford Motor Company gave out 50, 60, 70, 80 of these trucks. Most of them were like this, just regular cabs. Some were extended cabs. They're given out for youth or environmental work. And my uh, father, who was a forest ranger with the uh, New Brunswick Department of Resources, had this truck for the summer. So when it was turned back into um, Ford at the end of the summer, it went to uh, Wood Motors in Fredericton, New Brunswick. I was attending Maritime Forest Ranger School at the time. I had the serial number, I went down, and uh, both the Ford garages in Fredericton had a yard full of these white trucks. Uh, they're all the same color. They, ha they all had a sign on the door that said Ford working with youth. So anyways, I picked this up and uh, it only has um, 97,000 miles and that's original. And um, it was last year in Canada that the vehicles were in miles. After that in 78, they went to kilometers. So not too many modifications done to the truck. Last year I had the seat re-upholstered. Uh, the original seat uh, was blue and I prefer black trim or black accents. Eventually I'm going to change those door panels or paint them black. And one of the, one of the first modifications I did when I had this truck, I got this, this truck in the winter of 1978, I had this sliding rear window put in. And um, 20 years ago I had the truck done over and in this part of the world we have a lot of salt on the roads in the winter and uh, the box rusted out and the floor of the cab rusted out as well so about 20 years ago uh, Jim Hathaway Ford and Amherst uh, redid the truck for me the box the current box uh, came from Texas uh, the um, tailgate is off the original box and that's a, that's a change when it was painted the original letters on the truck were red I threw this old box liner in off, out of one of my old service trucks and because um, there was holes in the floor I wish I had got them to patch them but they didn't so I guess I threw that in to cover, cover it up. I'm thinking maybe I might uh, do a sprayed in liner like Linex. Um, hubcaps are not the original. The original hubcaps were just uh, gray with black accents that said Ford, Ford Motor Company on it. and. Um, Anyways, this box I just put on, actually the summer, I guess. Um, I always had a box of some sort on it and uh, I took it off, taken it off to put on another truck at some time. So I replaced that with a new one. And um, when I picked this truck up, it had, when I drove it off the lot, it had 5,900 miles exactly on it. And the only, the only damage to the truck was this, uh, this nick here on the mirror arm hit a bridge uh, and then there was one scratch in the box other than that uh, the truck looked brand new when I drove it off the lot and it's got a 302 automatic uh, I suppose one of the options I might have got uh, was the clearance lights and um, anyways so it's been with me since September 1977 um I paid cash for it at the time. Uh, it was just it came to just a little over five thousand two hundred dollars or so. I did a, a a calculation recently based on uh, inflation and in today's dollars it would be about twenty thousand dollars. And I'll just start it up before I end the video. I can say.